Butch Hatcher is a clean car fanatic who loves shining his BMW. This is a 2003. So imagine his surprise when a rental car company charged him hundreds in cleaning fees. They charged me $300 for a cleanup. But the cleaning fee was just one surprise. Butch's receipt showed a late fee of $140 a day for a week, even though he had returned the car. Their records show that the car wasn't turned in until a week later. Turns out he dropped the car off after hours. I called customer service and told him I had dropped it off. It was parked right in the front, and I put the key under the passenger side. Now, a national consumer group says it's getting complaints from all over the country from renters who say they turned in a rental car in pristine condition. But then a few days later, they got a bill for cleaning or damage. Car rental companies do like to broadside their customers with bills like this. Chris Elliott is founder of the consumer advocacy group, The Elliott Report. There's no one there, so you just drop the key off. Guess what? That's still your responsibility. Chris says to protect yourself, take cell phone photos of the rental car so they can't claim you damaged it. Show the rental car before, and then when you return the car, take pictures afterwards as well. Chris says you can never take too many pictures of a rental, and he says then save them for six months just in case. Butch Hatcher says he'll never drop off a rental again if there's no one there. So try to avoid overnight drop-offs and take pictures as you turn that car in. That we don't waste your money. I'm John Matteris, WCPO 9 News.